Whoops. Uh, Basil I.O., thank you so much for that subscription. Uh, that's Soapy Tuna. Thank you for pointing out that I'm resetting. <laughs> uh, the console kicked itself right there. <laughs> <laughs> Your pal Sean O'Mal, what's going on? Uh, I gotta do another giveaway soon. Yeah, I gotta figure out what to do. I mean, I actually think the computer giveaway went pretty well, and I've thought about doing maybe, like, a laptop or something. But... I don't know. I don't have, like, another mic and everything else that I had the last time. Who has any percent right now? Uh, Karua has all the records except Warpless, which Mitch has. Oakmeister, thank you for 12 months. Uh, no. <laughs> I wish everyone could have won it. Uh, I'm actually really happy the kid who won it. He's super nice. Yeah, he's super nice. Uh, you fly left so you can get over the wall and keep momentum. So if you drag the wall, you don't have momentum when you get on top of it. You want to, like, be going forward. It's just a small optimization. It's, I mean, it's not a huge deal, but, I mean, it, I think the thing is, like, over 50 levels, you know, like, any... If you save, you know, half a second on 50 level, each 50 levels, that adds up, really, you know what I mean? And that's basically what this game's about, is just saving... At this point, it's just saving, like, any small amount of time you can anywhere. Yeah. Sir Roderick, world record or bust? Uh, I don't think I'm gonna... I, 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 it's not really possible for me unless I got no death early hammer and my god run. <laughs> what do I prefer? Helps me more? Gift subs or direct donations? Same thing. They're exactly the same. It's really whatever you want to do. Uh, gift subs, you make everyone happy. Donations, you get text-to-speech. So It's really whatever you're trying... What, what, what way you're trying to do the... Uh, <laughs> two things. It doesn't matter to me. I don't care. I, I would never tell anyone how to spend their money. Um, honestly, the, the best ones for me are Twitch Prime because I know those are, like, not free, but they're not costing you anything extra that you weren't already paying. And then I, I feel that's a, a good deal, you know? <laughs> I appreciate the love, but I'm not going for early hammer, even. Uh, Dixon Cider. Well, it's like, uh, every, like, a bunch of people that are ahead of me are just early hammer runs. Yeah, a bunch of people that are ahead of me are just, like, these early hammer runs that are not even that, like, what do I want to say? They're not, like, better runs than my run that's just, like, they had early hammer, <laughs> you know? Uh, Curly Fry, thank you for 23 months. 10 months. 10 months longer than half a year. Uh, no, I'm not saying don't sub. Please sub. Please sub. I'm just saying, like, if you're talking about my level of guilt that I feel when it happens, Twitch Prime is the least amount of guilt. <laughs> but they're also the most fleeting. Oh, I dragged the wall. See, like, right there, if I would have went over the wall instead of hitting it, I would have gone faster, obviously. And it's the same idea for when you fly left. Yeah, it's the same idea. Sub guilt, exactly. I get sub guilt. Right? 
No, I was stoked to see Ninja on the cover of ESPN. I I think there's I, I don't I don't think like esports challenge the same thing as like you know NFL football or whatnot. But we're I mean I don't I don't think we're much we're much far off from golf or like bowling at the worst. You know what I mean? And we're certainly a lot more entertaining. So, are gift subs the most guilt-laden? No. I love gift subs, because then you can... The person can resub for only a dollar. Thoughts on Tiger winning? I mean, he's looking pretty fucking good right now, I would say. Uh, Regulus, thank you so much for 500 bits. I greatly appreciate it. Don't bowling dudes get tendonitis? Uh, dude. Have you ever seen the video of the gamer mashing, and then he blows his fucking wrist out? All these, you know what's gonna happen to all the gamers in 10 years is that their wrists and hands are gonna be completely warped. I can already tell that I'm starting to just like have a claw instead of like a normal hand because I hold a controller so much. Yo, the Detroit Lions, baby? Where's my boy Angry Pug? Better donate that $50. Clip that. <laughs> we made a bet. Yeah, I feel like that would be the same for like drummers or like, you know, guitar players or bass players. They would probably have the same thing happen, for sure. Doesn't mean you can't do it forever, but there is going to be like pain associated or whatever. But like getting back to what I was saying is like, we're not the same tradition, but we're closer. I mean, I, I would say we're not much different than, you know, other things closely related to that as far as like physical skill, the quote unquote physical skill required. Um, and I think mentally what's required of esports, especially in a game like Fortnite, which I'm not going to lie, like the skill level in Fortnite's stupid fucking high because of so many things are going on at one time. Like the, me the mental preparation or the, um, the quickness at which you have to make maneuvers, you know what I mean? Like, if I have to do something frame perfect, like, that's requiring split-second decision and split-second timing, uh, I think that, those things are comparable. And that's why, like, I don't know, I don't really have a problem with regular sports covering esports or whatever. And that's why I don't think there's a problem with that. I think ultimately, shit. I think ultimately, what it comes down to is what people want to see. You know what I mean? Because uh, sports are entertainment and games. You know what I mean? At the end of the day, they're just games, and um, it's just ultimately what people want to see. You know what I mean? Is this the only game where Mario runs faster than his fireballs? Maybe Mario, not Mario 1, yeah. Maybe, I don't know, maybe. I never even really thought about that. Uh, Juanito, thank you for continuing the gift sub. Um, and taking advantage of September. For only a dollar. It's 2 5 uh, it just depends on where the Hammer Brother is. Uh, 2 4 is actually a little bit faster uh, than 2 5. But it's very close. And it just depends on where the Hammer Brothers at. Like, if the Hammer Brothers down, it's not worth the extra map movement spaces. 2-5 is also significantly easier, I would say, than 2-4. So, I don't... Most runners are not going to be mad if 2-5 pops up compared to 2-4. As far as the RNG is concerned. Uh, Belgar, thank you for the marbles. Uh, Chase W. Saunders. The power of positivity, baby. That's what I need. Uh, I don't think you can sub in the Twitch app, but I could be wrong. But you can, like, just go on your normal browser on your phone and then do all the same sub stuff. Yo, Tofu, what's going on, baby? Oh my god, seven seconds. Hoid Rage, thank you for those bits. Regulas, thank you for the bits. I greatly appreciate it. How's the weather where I'm at? Oh, uh, it's getting chilly. Uh, SSG Rogue, thank you so much. But it is starting to warm up. We're, I think we're getting one like last burst of summer. 
uh, next week. It's gonna be in like the 80s in Portland, which is crazy. What's my me next big endeavor as far as game ROM hack, etc.? Um, well, Just Cook's ROM hack's gonna come out. I'm definitely gonna play that through that. Um, and of course, Grand Pooh World 2 is something that I want to play through. Um, so both of those I think are going to Ooh. to do that. Yeah, Invictus and Grand Pooh World 2 are gonna be the two, but. I mean, I don't know, I kind of want to see Laser Belch, like, I don't think I'm, I don't know if I'll speedrun Grand Pooh World 2, because I don't know, there's something weird about, like, not that I won't speedrun it at all, but, like, I don't think I'll push the world record, because, A, I think Laser Belch is going to try and do it no matter what, and I, I respect what he did in GPW1, um, but B, I feel like you can't do that for the ones named after you, like, I feel like that, like, I don't know, like, I just feel like there's weird traditions that you can't break, you know? Like, I am so pumped for it, though. Yeah, dude, Laser Belch, I'm so happy for that. Are my donation alerts not on? No, they're on. I don't know why they wouldn't be coming through. Are you donating? You're donating through the Muxy one, right? Um, I'm not seeing any donations on my thing right here. I don't know, PayPal's down, or there's an issue, or something. Uh, yeah, but what link did you use, Leland? Like, did you use the Muxy link? You can't just, like, send money directly to the PayPal. Chase! Hey, man. There you go. See, that one went through. Hey, man! Yo, Matthew! Uh, well, I'll let, will I let Laser play it before I play it? No. <laughs> Fuck no, I'm gonna play it as soon as Barb releases it. If Barb would give me Grand Pooh World early, I'd be playing it now. Yeah. I, if Barb would give me a demo, I would have started it already. If he gave it to me level by level, drip by drip, I'd fucking play it. Yeah. I have not played SMB3 on the Switch yet. I honestly haven't even gotten, um... I've played Ice Hockey, which actually was pretty fun. I liked Ice Hockey. Um, that was, that was actually a pretty enjoyable experience, but Ice Hockey is not a game that I'm super concerned about the latency. And weirdly, the NES Ice Hockey, like, holds up. Uh, Mr. Banana Grabber, thank you so much for continuing that sub. Ice Hockey was a great game as a kid. Uh, Jesus, you should check out, check out Super Blood Hockey on Steam. It's like an Ice Hockey sequel, but, you know, made in today. No, I screwed up. Ice Hockey, I think Ice Hockey was better than Blades of Steel. I actually think Blades of Steel and, oh my god, what was the NBA one? This is gonna bother me now. Oh, Double Dribble. Double Dribble are both not that good at games. The best NES basketball game is Hoops. I don't know if you guys ever heard of that one. That's the best NES basketball game. I used to play the shit out of Hoops. All skinny dudes on your team? I feel like you go skinny dudes and one fat dude is the way you roll your ice hockey team. Three skinnies, one fat. Oh, Arch Rivals? Okay. Arch Rivals is pretty good. I don't know, man. I like hoops, though. Hoops is like, hoops have these like really dope dunk animations. Speedball to pop? No. Arch Rivals was dope, though. Okay, you guys, you guys might be right. Arch Rivals is really good. <laughs> Bowsette blowing up the internet, dude. If I can, I'll have a Bowsette emote by the end of the fucking day. NBA Run and Gun for SNES was the best one for the SNES era. I mean, NBA Live '95 is really good, but NBA Run and Gun is the best sports game of the SNES era. NBA Run and Gun, like, you could just, 
you were just through alley oops the whole fucking time. It was fucking awesome. <laughs> Thank you, Am Zero. I greatly appreciate that sub. I don't know why it's not getting the gift subs resubs, though. I don't know why it's not sharing those. You might have to refresh it and then hit share. NBA Jam is really good, but I think I would take NBA Run and Gun over NBA Jam, like on a desert island. Big problem with NBA Jam is just like the rubber banding. Oh my god, just lose all the time right there. That was embarrassing. That was not a good fight. <laughs> Jordan vs. Bird with the convoluted dunk contest. Uh, Long Road Gaming thing for 13 months. Uh, no, NBA Run and Gun, it's like a five-on-five -five NBA basketball game for Super Nintendo. It was also in the... It was also in the arcades, but as a different name. It wasn't Run and Gun in the arcades. I forget what they called it in the arcades. I went to a concert recently in Memphis and they started playing Africa and it made me think of you. Then, the next day, Gamestop did a skit about trades at conference based on the song. Bless the trades, it's a good song. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Thank you so much, Chase. Pooh, hey. can you provide any insight on how to clip the door on 7-1? Oh, on how to what? Clip the wall on 7-1? All right. What you need to do is you need to jump into the corner. <laughs> and I wish there was more I could tell you. Unfortunately, that's that's literally all the help I can give you. Um, you kind of just throw your head into the right. You gotta you gotta kind of like figure out what the right pixel is. You kind of just trial and error until you figure out exactly what the right pixel is. Um, I know that was advice worth $5 right there. Um, I know that sounds really bad. Um, you have to, you can't do it small. Leland, you can't, you have to be big. Yeah, you can't do it small. If you do it small, you have to clip downwards. I mean, you could clip, but you have to clip the pipe if you do it small. Sorry, I gotta concentrate on this level. This level's actually pretty effing hard. Ooh. Yeah, also you don't want the tail. Exactly, you wanna just be Fire Mario or regular Mario. I'm just killing both of these guys. I'm skipping the next one. Hey, Moni. I know. I feel bad. I feel like I'm keeping you busy. Y'all, Moni's amazing. Yeah, but I, I, I wish there was a good way to explain clipping in this game, but you just kind of throw your head in the corner. No! I want a P-Speed right there. 
What's up, girl? What are you doing? Oh, she's taking a picture of me. I was like, <laughs> it's right in my face. <laughs> oh, it's right in my face. What a ROM hack is this? It's pretty tame. This is just regular everyday SMB3. I have to run this every few months just so I can keep my real speedrunner card. Otherwise, they'll take it away if I just run the ROM hacks. They'll be like, oh, that, that, that's when they discredit me is when, is when you just run ROM hacks. Oh, nobody else runs those games. Yeah, bitch, because you can't. So I have to run Mario 3 every once in a while. <laughs> it's like a pilot's license. You gotta get the hours in. Not, I tell you right now, not everyone would like running ROM hacks. They're, um, they're a different breed. Did I see Bowsette? I'm, I love Bowsette. Do I still enjoy running vanilla? Uh, can I tell you guys a secret? Running a ROM hack or running vanilla, it's just as hard. It's just the difference is in ROM hacks, usually when you... It's like everything's separated by like minutes more so than like minute seconds. ROM hacks are like you can Yo, Mitch Flower Power. Oh my god, I gotta add the emote. I haven't added the emote yet. Um Mitch Flower Power, ladies and gentlemen. I love that man. Dude, I had so much fun last week. I've like, I have no doubles partner right now. Thank you so much. Uh, Reggie Ray, thank you for a year. I enjoy toast, thank you for four months. Shout out to Mitch Flower Power, ladies and gentlemen. Sexiest man alive. Oh man, that was so much fun. I just wanna play video games all the time. It was awesome, it was just really fun. And productive. And I feel like, you know what I feel like when we took an even bigger step in though? Is we took a bigger step, my Fortnite game took a bigger step. Like that's what I feel like really took a step up last week. You had Panda Express? Dude, it's good. <laughs> it's, it's... <laughs> Panda Express is good. Uh, Boombox Beats, thank you for 10 months in a row. Um, I don't know. Mitch has done that category. SMB3 all categories. You have to, you have, you gotta include a Famicom too though, or it's like, what's the point? <laughs> I'm just fucking around. Uh, Careless Rex. Yo, what's going on, man? Yo, Careless, I'm a fan, dude. I like what you do. You got a nice positive attitude. I'm a fan. Yeah, well, I you know what? The last like month and a half I've been working on what's going on, Tampa? The last month and a half I've been working on getting my edits down. Like, cause I switched to shift. So shift used to be run, then I have auto run. So now I switch shift to edit. And it took forever, and now I feel like I actually got it down pretty decent. And, um... And I'm feeling pretty, pretty good on it. Yeah, I should've just, I should've just put the... Put the World 4 ones to sleep. I don't know why I fought them. Will the SMB3 any percent co-op be added to speedrun.com? Yes. I know, Moni. We need a squad. I don't know why I waited till five to put these ones to sleep, because now I have to... No, I don't. Wait, I don't have to get this one, then. Or yes, I do. I do have to get this one. Now I can't remember. 
Oh my god. Uh, Rift Brothers is awesome. Rift Brothers, the best, I think the best SMB3 ROM hack I've ever played, honestly. It's really good. I'll never beat the record in this? Yeah, probably not, no. I don't think I would ever, I don't think I ever want to dedicate the multiple years of my life it would take to, to beat the record of this at this point. No. Oh shit! No, I'm good. Are pipes in Mario 3 as hard as the ones in Mario World? Um, I think pipes are harder in Mario 3, but I think... No! Actually, no, Mario World's got worse pipes and doors. Yeah, it's really, really good. He did some thing in Rift. He did. Freaking Hot did some really cool things in Rift Brothers that I honestly had never seen before. I need a P-Speed emote. I had one, but I got rid of it. Do I hope Bowser becomes canon? Yeah, I don't have a problem with there being Lady Bowsers or Lady Boos. I mean, it'd be really weird if there were only dude Boos around, I think. I mean... I feel like Lady Yoshizo is Birdo, right? I don't want to disrespect Birdo. Yo, Ben, thank you for four months. Lady Boo exists in Paper Mario? Funny thing is, that's how Lady Poo got her name. We all know she's a big Paper Mario fan. Everyone thinks it's because my name was Pooh and she's a lady. <laughs> now I'm making name. Why did I? I didn't need to do that. I didn't need to wait. It doesn't matter. 80. I don't. It doesn't matter. 88. I can have 88. And then I pick my name off her name. <laughs> Have I spied on Barb making Grand Poo World 2? I've seen a little bit of it here and there. Um, through like clips and I mean, other things that have just been on the interwebs. Um, but I haven't like sat down and watched him for hours on end. You know, I've checked in with him. I mean, I've ch I've chatted, I've chatted a few times in there while he's made it, and the people have yelled at me to get out, or I've realized what he's doing and stuff. But you know, I mean, it's not like I'm, it's not like I have. I would say I'm gonna be like 99.9% .9 blind, not probably a hundred. Yeah. I would say I've seen like a trailer's amount of info. You know. I think the hard part is that I really like Barb's stream. And not only that, I really like Barb's creation streams, but I, I don't really get to watch them. Uh, do clouds present hand, prevent hands in World 8? Sure. But why would you skip a level you might not play instead of skipping a level you definitely are going to play? Barb doesn't idolize me. We're friends, man. Barb is... Barb, like, inspires me. I idolize him. 
I lo like what Barb's done in such a short period of time is incredible on Twitch alone, like as a broadcaster. But then, like, what he creates is just. I don't know. It's insane. Five hundred hours on stream, yeah. Oh, he's putting in tons of hours on this. Hey, Fiend, what's going on? Sup, girl? Oh, I almost died right there. Oh, I almost died right there. This close. Okay, I need these Hammer Brothers to possibly switch spots. I screwed up. Shella Rells, thank you for continuing the gift sub from Scott Zira. Zeramos, thank you so much for subbing two months in a row. I greatly appreciate that. All right, I need this hand, brother. Move right, move right, move right, move right, move right. Hey. No. Yo, DC Izzy, thank you for five months in a row. Uh, when Feeny fixed the car and left everyone to die on Friday the 13th? Yeah. I don't know what happened. Like, me and Feeny used to always get out on boats together, and then all of a sudden she was just like, Nah, screw you, Chad Kensington. I'm boating myself. <laughs> Barb said most Mario Makers are connected. Um, oh yeah, 100%. I, a Mario Maker, the Mario Maker community is way different than, than any gaming community out there, in my opinion. And, oh my god, I was so slow. <laughs> that was so slow. If Karua was here, he'd fucking, he's, he would slap his face. He'd be really pissed off about that level if Karua was here. Mitch, Mitch is probably disappointed in that level too. I need to pra I need to sadly practice P-winging that level. Um, but yeah, I think the Mario Maker community, um, the streamers especially, are just are very connected. Um, I think we have a genuine care, uh, a genuine concern for each other's success to a certain degree, as much as we possibly can help. And um, I know for a fact we have a deep desire to work together and collaborate. Um, and do things together uh, and just hang out like we're just friends yeah I think we're friends beyond it I think it's, it's something that's gone way beyond the game at this point especially as we've branched out into different games and different genres um, I think the all those things have still stayed together you know what I mean yeah exactly yeah Mario Maker is very special and unique that way Exactly. Um, I, I, I think Mario Maker is cool because it's not like, even a game like, what do I want to say, like, 
I don't know, it's it's so, it's a game that's very, I don't know, it lends itself, it's a creative game, it's a game about creativity, both in the way you play it and the way you, you know, actually physically make levels. Um, I think that plays a part because, you know, it's not, like most of speedrunning, it's going to be more collaborative because of that. Yeah, I, I mean, it's just, I don't know, it's unique, it's very unique. It's very different than any other community I've ever been a part of. I think it's also, I think it also plays a role that it's not the biggest community, you know what I mean? I mean, I think that's why speedrunning kind of is still benefits from that. It's not, you know, a giant community. So it gets easy to know everyone. Also, like, Mario Maker's leaders are all really nice, cool people. You know? Generally. <laughs> yeah. Ed George, thank you for that Twitch Prime description. Yeah, like, Ryu, man, Ryu's so nice. <laughs> He's so nice. Ryu's so nice, sometimes I'm like, is he mocking me right now? But no, he's just that nice. <laughs> All right, here we go. I'm gonna show you guys how to clip this. The first try, because you're going a little fast, you want to duck jump, but you don't need to duck jump. And then you just kind of like hit your head in the wall. Yeah, that was a good one, actually. Oh yeah, there you go. <laughs> like, that's what you do. I didn't do anything special. I just slammed my head into a wall. That's all you do. Oh my God, Aura is the, f Aura is like the funniest human being alive. Y'all don't even know. Oh. This is not good. Oh, that almost got really bad. Oh my god. Dude, Aura's also, like, pimping. That's the one thing you guys don't know about Order, man. I think he's got, like, he's got, like, mad groupies. Okay, so, like, Cobaldin and Notch had the, they were definitely our two biggest donators um, for MMC last year. Number three, Aura's, Aura's group of lady lovers. You're right. I mean, I got a pretty good like mic voice. You know, I could I could I could do the radio thing, but Aura man, they that thing just That's pure sex. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, what's going on, Sven? It's just pure sex. Speedrun groupies weren't a thing? Uh speedrun groupies aren't, but Aura groupies, they are. <laughs> uh, Teravin, thank you so much for that sub. I greatly appreciate it. Uh, did I? I think I miss uh, Ragnarok Force as well. Probably not cool. Uh, which speedruns of Mario do I love to watch? Um, I don't, I mean, I watch a lot of speedrunning in general. I don't just watch Mario. Honestly, like, right, like, lately, I've been watching... I always watch Super Metroid, like, I love Oats and Goats, and I love Rando, so I watch Andy. You know, I love those guys. 
Um, but I like, um, I mean, I, I've been watching a lot of Ray's Fire, um, with Fortnite lately. Which is nice because he's a really high level player and a speedrunner. Shit. Damn it. I'm just screwed. Rage! Is it true that Order only has one monotone voice and never changes? Um, I spent three days with him last year, and I wouldn't say I heard much inflection on his voice. But, like, what I will say is that he's, like, so fucking funny. I don't know. He's just, like, everything he says is just... It's the best. I Like, if I ever had... If I ever had to get a voiceover person, I would hire Order. Will he be at MMC? He will be at MMC. The creators realize how OP the Amor suit was? Well, it isn't, isn't it? Like, you can't kill this, um, this little guy. The Koopa Kids. Dude, Mario 3 is a hard game to speedrun. It's a hard game. aren't that bad I mean I think I think if you use a tracker um, a rando like your first couple are gonna be hard um, but after a while you figure it out and then there's there's good videos on the internet that are like be good guides on like how to clear each dungeon like if, if first you learn how to clear each dungeon complete you know what I mean and then you will learn like after that you'll just kind of learn the layout of the dungeon so you'll learn like I have this I can go here now instead and skip that there. You know what I mean? You just kind of learn it. <laughs> Dude, SMB3 is a whole different game, Matthew. Inverted key sanity. Yo, Andy, I sent you a Discord message. I think, I think it's about something that you would want to do, and we want to do it next week. <laughs> Point seven six, man. Come on. Well, I mean, hey, you know, you can't. First of all, first of all, that was date one, date two. We're gonna hit, we're gonna hit date three next week. You'll be able to do it all you want. Uh, BDF, I will say, if you want it, I will say Warp World, uh, starting this Sunday, the Warp World Twitter account is going to have a multitude of announcements, uh, including about the future of the product formerly known as Bit Races. Uh, the Warp World podcast will have announcements about all sorts of things. Lots of cool announcements. So follow the Warp World Twitter account. While you're at it, you know what? Follow my Twitter account too. Just while you're at it, just go ahead and follow my Twitter account. Just go ahead and do that too. Team Warp World. At Team Warp World. I should put the Warp World Twitter in there, too. At Team Warp World is the Warp World Twitter.
Oh, I missed. Uh, am I gonna do some Mario Party Friend Fridays? Well, the new Mario Party doesn't have, like, the actual board game in it, which is pretty lame. Yeah, dude, I bought I bought Age of Empires for me. I bought, I bought it for all of us, Barb. I was, I was secretly trying to get them to play Age of Empires. Yo, will you play it this Friday? Can we play Age this Friday? Because I'm doing a 24-hour stream this Friday. I need more games. Age of Empires, I think, would be a good game to mix in there. Age of Empires with friends? That would be a really good game for me. Yes. Can we do it this Friday? Y'all, I'm gonna have to play Resident Evil 2. I'm gonna have to bust out my Resident Evil 2 disc and play it on a regular PlayStation, because they don't make a PC version. All right, Age of Empires 2, Friend Friday, done and done. Yo, Matthew, you want in? Age of Empires 2 HD, that's what we got. A lot of people requested Earthworm Jim, and I think a lot of people forget how bad a game Earthworm Jim is. <laughs> we might mix it in. Right now, my list here, I got Mario World 96 Exit, ni in the 96. That's what we're gonna start with. <laughs> He's a groovy guy. Uh, we're gonna start with 96 Exit. I'm going to do Spelunky. I'm going to do, oh, what did I have on here? We're gonna do Mario Maker 100 Man. Uh, we're gonna play through all of, damn it, man. You know, I've never had a no hand PB in Mario 3, guys. I've been running this game for the better part of three years, and I've never had no hand PB. I've gotten no hands in a run, I've just never PB'd with it. Yeah. Uh, Splunky HD, not Splunky, sorry. Splunky HD. I'll try and get at least one win in. Uh, Resident Evil 2, Star Fox 64. Um, Yoshi's Island. I might not need that more games. Friend Friday, so Age of Empires. Yeah, I might not need that many more games now that I look at it. Mario Maker 100 Mans. That's how I'm going to convince everyone to come in in the first place. Okay, this is not good. Okay, that was a bad turn of events, I'm not gonna lie. No, I don't play Age of Empires, but I'm going to this week. AoE games take us one to two hours each, as far as planning out my extreme. Oh, that's fine. I don't really need to plan it out too much. Until dawn, until dawn. I don't know if- I don't want to play a story game. I feel like I need games with a modicum amount of action. Oh, shit. Damn it. I feel like I need games with, like, some action. Pretty late. The board game mode is not online for the new Mario Party. Sidereon. I know. The sun screwed me up right there, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't kill the sun, so I was nervous I was gonna get hit. Yeah, minigames only online. It's bullshit. Sweet and sour and honey, did it change your life? I don't know why I love it so much, but, like, some things just work. I 
I know, it's crap. Pretty much. Yokozuna is the greatest WWE champion of all time? No, I don't think that. <laughs> uh, any chance of beating SMB3 in a frog suit? There are frog suit runs out there. You should check out the frog suit tasks. Actually, it's really good. Um, but there's some levels you can't beat as a human with the frog suit. I guess maybe you could, but... No, I'm gonna lose hammer right before Bowser is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get hit by that fireball. Hardest level in the game, y'all. <laughs> y'all, it's Brock Lesnar. Is this PB Pace? Um, it's, it's gonna be close. Yeah, it's gonna be really close, honestly. Yeah, it's gonna be, it's gonna be in the, in the realm. Taking the easy way. Mm. I don't think so. Actually, is that... I know, messed up. Wanna reset. Yeah, I think it is. Dude! Yo, two seconds, baby! Two seconds! <laughs> Yo, good run. That makes me happy. I'll take it. I will take it. You never want to PB by too much. First run of the day! What do I do for the rest of the stream? What do I do for the rest of the stream? Oh, man. I'm trying to beat it again. No, the stream's over, guys. It's only downhill from yeah. I mean, what I mean, we can't top that, man. Two second PB. Oh, I want to get an early hammer run, no hands one day. Like I just like I think about what the I think about what time I could have if like I just got perfect RNG. And like that's the thing with Mario Three is you're just fucking playing until like all this RNG rolls up. You know, like I'm just playing. I can do this over and over again, but I'm just playing until the perfect RNG rolls up. Like, if I didn't get hands right there, I'd blow my PB out of the water. 23 seconds. That was a great run, man. I was super pumped. That was fucking awesome. <coughs> no, I'm never playing the pinnacle of level design again. Oh! oh my god, I choked. I choked on water. Thank god I choked on water and not on the last level there. All right, here, here, let's uh, let's talk about this. Okay, so I have in the